Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome to the Jesuit High School Auditorium for this evening's spring concert presented by the Music Department of Jesuit High School. At this time, we would ask that everyone please take a moment to turn off all cell phones and any other electronic device that may interrupt this evening's concert. Photography and video recording will be permitted. We do ask, however, that you please turn off all external lighting, including the flash feature, as it can distract both the people around you and the performers on stage. Thank you.
Good evening, everybody, and thank you for coming out this evening on this awful night for weather and uh, many other things going on with Jazz Fest and Cinco de Mayo last night, but it's so good to have you here with us this evening celebrating our final concert of the year and uh, doing some recognition here of some parents and students who have just done so much for the band this year. So if you would just bear with us for a little bit, we're gonna do some of that recognition now. Uh, first of all, I'd like to welcome any new incoming families that may be joining the band next year. If you're an, an, uh, an incoming eighth grader next year uh, and you and your family are here, would you stand up? Uh, welcome. I'd like to thank Father Brown and Mr. Kernan for all of their support throughout the year. Uh, you know, the support of the administration is so instrumental in helping us do what we do, so thanks to both of them. I would like to thank our seniors, Jacob Tobler and Alex Weeks, for assisting DJ with the lights and setting up the auditorium. We've got a lot of extra time here. I'd like to thank Renee Johnson, who has spent so many hours helping do the decorating that you will see in the, uh, in the commons. I'd like to help also thank the, the moms and some dads who came and helped uh, Renee do the decorating. So I'll just call your name, and if you don't mind, just stand up so we can thank you. Renee and John Johnson, of course. Brenda Evans. <laughs> Zareda and Andy Castillo. Wayne Prado, Donna Tobler, Renee West, Cherie Albro, Donald Albro, Tiffany Young, Becky Fry, and Nicole Barley. Thanks to all of you for coming Friday and Saturday and doing the decoration. I'd like to also thank Mr. George Schwarz. He has been with us for a, a long time, doing all of the photography and videography that you see throughout the year. Uh, George, where are you? Oh, up in the booth. So everybody turn around and give George a quick uh, round of applause. <laughs> Going back to pre-camp, uh, every time the, the marching band performed, obviously we were in our band uniform and we could not have done it without the, uh, the help and organizational skills of Vicki Eschman. So Vicki, if you could stand up and we can thank you for all of the time and effort you put into coordinating the uniform committee. Thank you, Vicki. Another quick shout out and thank you to Renee Johnson who coordinates all of our band apparel, the golf shirts, the sweatshirts, the, the t-shirt, everything you see. So Renee, thank you for that. One more turnaround to the booth. We cannot go without thanking, of course, DJ Galliano, who does so much for the band. Also organizing the Disney trip, which is quite an undertaking. So thanks, DJ, for making the band look so good, the auditorium look so good, and uh, all the work you put in with the Disney trip as well. I'd like to have a quick thank you for all of the families that hosted our German guests this uh, fall. Uh, the students from the Claudius Gymnasium in Bamberg. Uh, it's, a, you know, it's a special exchange program we have and we could not do it without the host families. So please, if you hosted a pair of German students this fall, would you please stand up so we can thank you. They opened their homes for about seven or eight days to these young men and women and uh, it's, it's a special thing. So thank you for, for doing that. I'd like to thank our Band Booster Executive Board, Mr. John Tobler, John, and of course, John's wife, Donna, Frank Adam, and, and Jennifer, please stand up too, Jennifer. Thank you both. Jamie Hughes, and of course, Todd Hughes. Very good, and 
And then Becky Fry, and then Keith, her husband. Thank you for both. Thank you for everything you do. I'd like to ask John Tobler to come up to, so we can present him with his presidential plaque. I will read the plaque and then, of course, I will present it to John. In appreciation of his tireless dedication, work, and commitment to making the Blue Jay Band number one, this award is presented to John Tobler. I think John wants to say a quick word or two. certainly all of the five that we've been here at Jesuit, and I call him the Swiss Army Knife of the band. Uh, he lives up to that moniker all the time, uh, whether it's to be at an event early, stay late, clean up, set up, need a bus driver, Frank, need something fixed, Frank, cook jambalaya, Frank, throw a pizza party, write a note of charms, Frank, Frank, the band will miss you, but I want to send you off with a little token of our appreciation. Your very own Swiss Army Knife. recognition. Um, I have some thank you things for our fearless leader, Mr. Kaluta, for his work with the boys and the band throughout the year. Jeff. I have some people from Maestro wherever he is up top. Um, and I also have some things for Susan Dubois-Blanc and Chloe Crosby, thank you, um, for their time as the JAD coach and the JAD moderator. Always in the background, but always number one in our hearts, DJ. Thank you. <laughs> And, and I'd also like to recognize two people that are always, always, always at our events and uh, literally in the background, but walking many miles on a parade ride, uh, football, football, uh, up and down the football field, taking pictures, making video, cutting that stuff, putting it out there for everyone to enjoy. Uh, you will have a great pictorial history of your child's time it being involved with the band. And I want to have, have special recognition for Gene Newman and George Schwartz for their efforts. <laughs> last, last, I would like to ask that uh, all of our senior parents stand up. And, and with that, we're losing some, some very valuable folks, former band, band presidents, a first lady, um, Carlos, who is always here, uh, is, is the chief getter of ice and water and all things, and always, always is looking to help. We have lots of folks here who have done just immeasurable things throughout the years, and I want to thank them specifically. And while I won't dwell on 
uh, the need for help in the coming coming year. I do want to I do want to point out that our president Don, our incoming president Don Albro, Don, please stand. And uh, also recognize Brent Lawson and Jody Warrick. Give us a stand, guys. And, uh, thank you. Our vice president for next year. Thank you all very much, and uh, we look forward to uh, to the day that one of you stand right here when your son is, is graduating, and uh, and know all the enjoyment you'll get from being a part of this. Thank you. All right, now we'd like to do some recognition of some student achievements throughout the year. Students who have made the junior high concert band this year, please stand when I call your name. Carlos Gutierrez and Alex Rodriguez. <laughs> senior high, senior high concert band, when I call your name, please stand up. Bradley Eshman. Mark Johnson, Colin Torrance, Alex Weeks, and Frank Young. Good job, guys. Senior High Jazz Band, Mark Johnson and Luke Gilmore. I'd like to recognize our drum majors for this year. Two guys that have done a phenomenal job leading the band. Mr. Alex Weeks and Mr. Jacob Cobia. I'd like to recognize our underclassmen for their year of service to the band. They will be receiving a letter in the next week, but I do want to have them stand and be recognized tonight, so when I call your name, please stand. Sage is in starting with our eighth graders. Sage Zerdia, Dominic Broussard, J.D. Bruno, Connor Bissi, Andy Castillo, Sandy DeWinter, Cole Dodson, Colin Draw, Carlos Gutierrez, and Braden Hattier. Ben Hoppus, Whit Yacoboni, Anderson Lawson, Brian Livia Oriana, Andrew Nimmo, Alex Rodriguez, Jude Skiro, Pacron Sidisamwan, and Declan Woman. Our ninth graders, Harrison Evans, Andrew Fry, Grayson Gibbons. Avery Hughes, Brian Manzanares, Seth Neo, Tyler Friend, Noah Pelicano, Dominic Roberts, Joe Merrick, Connor Wilkin, and Eric Shang. Our 10th graders, Matthew Alvaro, Jonathan Cho, Joseph Coletti, Aiden Raw, Luke Hunter, Hunter Jones, Lucas Knowles, Jonathan Liu, John Mansfield, Foster McDaniel, 
Romel Robin, Brian Santos, Matthew Torrance, and Frank Young. Our 11th graders and next year's senior leaders, Max Bartlett, Gillian Molu, Benjamin Cedro, Cameron Darshani, Bradley Eshman, Harrison Harley, Mark Johnson, Matthew Pointer, John Rose, Mark Sagastumi, Joshua Solomon, and Owen West. And now we come to the part of the program, the most difficult part, where we bring our seniors up and say goodbye officially to them and their families. So what I would ask is that all the senior parents come up to the front here. I'll have your sons join you. And then as soon as we finish, uh, we're going to take pictures very quickly in the middle here, Mr. Giacconi, myself, and your family. Uh, but if you could come up here and seniors, if you would come and join your parents up in the front of the auditorium stage here. Andrew Davis. Scott Fisher, Jacob Foster, Joshua Fuentes, Luke Gilmore, Andrew Nada, Ryan Lee, Gabriel Schwartz. Sebastian Seals, Jacob Tobler, Colin Torrance, and Alex Weeks. I just have a few words and then we will go ahead and take the individual pictures, so. Tonight, we are blessed once again with the opportunity to gather again as the Blue Jay Band family, celebrating our common love of music and sharing in this experience with our seniors and their families one final time. To our senior parents, hard to believe, right? Over the last five years, you've watched four graduating classes stand up here, but tonight, it's you. I know that at this moment you are filled with a symphony of emotions, happiness, gratitude, surely some sadness, and probably even some major disbelief that your son's high school years have come and gone so quickly. Every graduating class has its own identity and a special legacy that it leaves behind. As you well know, this class has faced many challenges during their time here at Jesuit. However, they never let any of these challenges stand in their way, excelling despite them. The class of 2023 will be known for its resilience and its quiet, humble leadership. They have set the bar very high with their success both on and off the field, the musical field. Most importantly, these young, have done, the young men have done this with grace and humility always leading by example every time we rehearsed and performed. Parents, you understood very early on the impact that music would have on your son's spiritual, emotional, and intellectual development. Thank you for making music a priority in your son's life. These young men are eternally blessed that you put music at the forefront of their education and especially during their time here at Jesuit. The fruits of that decision will continue to be realized long after they leave Jesuit and embark on the next phase of their life's journey. It has been my honor and privilege to share in this journey with you, and together we have watched your sons 
truly become men for others. To the class of 2023, there are so many special memories that we have shared over the last five years. You are the first graduating class in the history of Jesuit High School and the band to perform the Blue Jay March in its entirety since its composition by Professor Michael Capero in 1934, almost 90 years ago. You were selected two years in a row to perform in the prestigious Main Street March in the Magic Kingdom in Walt Disney World. You have performed in concerts and marching festivals, receiving superior sweepstakes and ratings at each one. Three Walt Disney World performance trips, countless football games and basketball games, Mardi Gras parades, and even traveled internationally with the Blue Jay Band to some of the most beautiful and exotic places in the world. Most importantly, at the center of every one of these experiences was music. And wherever your future takes you, continue to make music a part of your life. Share your gifts and talents with the world. The world will certainly be a much better and brighter place for it. Stay close to God and find your passion in life. I promise you, there too, you will find your happiness and your success. Congratulations to you, the graduating class of 2023. And as you leave us tonight, know how much we will miss you, but also know that you will forever be a part of the Blue Jay Band family. Congratulations, guys. So, if, Mr. Kong, are you down? Okay, great. If we could just have the, uh, maybe step off to the side real quick, we'll come down and take a quick picture with the senior families and then we'll continue with the concert. So we have a couple of pieces we're gonna finish with. The next piece we're gonna do is called Halcyon Hearts. I'd like to just read some composer notes about this piece before we play it. First of all, the word Halcyon, means denoting a period of time in the past that was idyllically happy, joyful, and peaceful. The composer, Kataj Copley, says about this particular piece, the effect of love on humanity is abundant, and I think we forget that from time to time. Regardless of race, gender, religion, or indifference, we are all united by a common thread, passion and love. Centered around the warmth that love brings, Halcyon Hearts takes us on an unexpected journey to find love. While this love may, res uh, may result to be romantic for some, to me, is about the moment someone finds their passion. Using colors, natural energy, and passion, I have created a sound of ambition for the ensemble. I'd like to dedicate this piece to those who love all of mankind, no matter the negativity around you. Let love be love and always choose it. When you do, the halcyon days will come. So those are the composer's notes about this particular piece of music. So as we play it, we would like to dedicate this piece to all of the graduating seniors and their families. Thank you for, uh, for the five years you have given us and we hope to see you again soon. Halcyon Hearts.
So we're going to finish with our last piece that the concert band will play. And then after that, we'll do a quick transition, and the jazz band will be right up. So hang tight when we finish. We'll do it quickly. And thanks again for being here with us and sharing this evening.
Blue Jay Council Band. Thank you again. Please stick around. We're going to do a quick transition, and the jazz band will be right out. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, please give it up for the Jesuit High School Jazz Band.
Who wants to go to Jazz Fest when it's wet and stuff and, and, and messy and you just want to come to the Jazz concert? We're going to just start making, making you know, that's, just come here and stand, right? Right, right. We got some great solos right here. Um, back there, we had Senior Jacob Tober on Sutafol. And uh, somewhere, he went to go get his other horn there. We had uh, Mr. Andy Castillo back there on Sutafol. There he is, all right. Uh, back there on drums, Mr. Senior Luke Gilmore. And then uh, Senior Mr. Alice Sweets on tenor saxophone. And uh, Senior Trombonist, Mr. Andrew Nata. Uh, the cool thing about this song is like, we're gonna look at the music on the page and then I go, okay, you're gonna have to unlearn what you learned. So that's what we've been I'm most proud about with this group is that we can look at the music on a page, but then I can tell them to close their eyes and they can still play it, and then we can change things up. And uh, for y'all, everything we've seen was correct. So that's musical mag magic there, musical magic there. So we're gonna keep this party going on here. Uh, we're gonna pull up uh, Mr. Uh, Junior Mark Johnson on flugelhorn here. We're gonna feature him on, on this song. And back there, Mr. Uh, Jacob Foster back there on piano. We have any Billy Joel fans? <laughs> Awesome, yeah. Why go to Jazz Fest when you can come to the, the auditorium at Jesuit? <laughs> All right, sit back and enjoy just the way you are.
Global Horn. Mr. Jacob Foster back there on piano. Mr. Owen West on alto saxophone. Mr. Dominic Roberts back there on drums. We got a lot of new guys on drums back there. We're really proud because we're, we're, we're losing the loop this year, which we're sad. And, but he's been holding the reins. These guys like Mr. G, I think we're ready for this. And I, I think these guys are up for the challenge there, don't you think? Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. All right, this next piece we have for you, if this is your mission here, if you, if you accept it, take it, right? Uh, I can't leave a concert without a joke, right guys? Yeah. Yes, that's right, all right. Okay. Um, we're gonna be featuring back there, uh, Mr. Lou Gilmore on drums. So, uh, and, uh, yeah. Right. And uh, back there, Mr. Jacob Foster on piano. So uh, enjoy, sit back and relax. And uh, I promise you, this uh, this this song will not self-destruct after we play it.
This next piece we have for you is called Frankenstein, but not the monster. All right, uh, so don't be afraid on that unless you like the uh, the jazzy, funky monsters or something like that. Yeah, that's great. All right, so sit back and relax. This is Frankenstein.
that's just fun. I hope it's just as fun for me up there as it's for y'all. Right? Yes. All right. Um, I wanted to uh, to thank my seniors up here as well. If you're a senior in the jazz band, please stand, arise, or wave, skip it up. We really miss these guys. They really stepped up, and the leadership has been instilled upon the, the jazz band. And we've got to do so many new things and new types of music that we couldn't have done without these guys. So thank you guys. Awesome, awesome. All right, we have one more left. All right, I always say there's a dance floor, but uh, actually, is it anyone's? Well, I only have one, but whose birthday is it today? Any birthdays? Yes, we have a birthday. We have a birthday. I have a, a, a towel here. Happy birthday. Yes, sir. Happy birthday. So this next piece we have for you, we're going to be featuring, uh, you know, this is this is awesome here. Uh, I knew, knew this, this young gentleman could sing, and if you went to the Christmas concert, here you got a chance to hear Mr. Colin Torrey sing with Mr. Lou Gilmore, right? And, so we're going to be featuring Mr. Colin Torrance on vocals, and then back there we have Mr. Mr. Luke Gilmore on drums. So, you know, we're going to be featuring flash dance. Oh, what a feeling. So this is going to be fantastic. All right. So sit back and relax, and, uh, and, 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 and sir, you can feel free to wave the towel, too. All right. All right. Again, let's give it up for Mr. DJ Galliano in the booth up there. And Mr. Kluda and the concert band. And if you really, really enjoyed this music, thank you for coming out and supporting the music here at Jesuit High School. Thank you so much for coming out. Because this party is just going to continue after this. We're going to go eat some jambalaya. And, you know, maybe these young gentlemen can win some prizes with the tickets. So I know they're really excited about that. So sit back and relax. Any flash dance fans out there? All right, maybe you came to hear me. Uh, not talk and, and these guys play, so I'm gonna be quiet now. So, all right, but I have to change my hands.
And I, I, I was taken over by the, the Frankenstein monster, I guess. Uh, Mr. Harrison Evans was playing a tremendous guitar solo on the previous song. Right. Let's give up to the jazz band. Take a bow, jazz. Take a bow. Everybody stand up. All right, if you're already standing up, yeah, one, two, three. Thank you for coming out, but the party's still going on in the comments. Thank you for coming out. God bless. See you soon.